up guys? Rob from Jermaine's Gaming here, bringing you an episode today of our new Let's Play, Saltwater Sport Fishing. And this is the saltwater version of Big Bass Fishing, which I did a full Let's Play of earlier. And we're going to be doing the same exact mode, arcade mode. It's going to be the same exact kind of format. Two areas per video. Two areas per video, and then we'll switch on to the next video. There's 12 areas total in this game, so we'll have about six episodes, and then we'll have to go over on the episodes after six, because I'm not going to catch every single fish in this game in arcade mode. i just putting that out there right now. There is a lot more fish in this game than in big bass fishing, if I remember correctly. Again, I haven't played this game in a long time, and I didn't look anything about this game up before I did this Let's Play. If I'm correct, though... There's a lot more fish in this game than in big bass fishing, so we'll have to see. If I can, if I, which I most likely won't be able to catch every single fish in arcade mode, I'll go back into practice mode and catch all the fish in practice mode. I don't know if arcade mode unlocks all the areas for practice mode. I might have to do the challenges for practice mode area unlocks, so the full encyclopedia of fish may take a little bit longer if I have to do all the challenges because there's three challenges per area so that'll be 36 challenges in total so it might take a little bit but essentially this game works the same way five minutes to catch five fish in each area each fish gives you a time bonus you have to select your lure but, un but unlike in the other game this game doesn't tell you what each fish in the area likes you just kinda have to figure it out and you also have to select the weight of your line because different fish require different line weights and different fish some fish also won't bite with heavier line. Like this kind of yellow and blue fish you're seeing right now, the dolphin fish isn't going to bite a 130 pound line. Yeah, see, line shy means that the line is too thick. It's not going to bite it. 130 pound line, however, is perfect for this guy, which is the blue marlin, who is the biggest fish in this first area. Just to make sure the game worked, I played through the first two areas, so I know what fish are in the first two areas vaguely. I don't remember what's past that, though. But this, the fighting sequence essentially plays the same, however, in this game it's a lot more reactive. Like, you can fight the fish a lot more, you see I could go left and right almost every single time. Whereas in Big Bass Fishing, you would not be able to pull the fish all the time. Fish also tend to jump a little less in this game than in the other one. They still jump though, but we're gonna go ahead and put on a sardine and see if we can't catch one of these other kind of fish that are floating around here. Not really you, I think you'll snap my line. Yeah. That's a tuna. Blue tuna will snap too thin of a line. You will absolutely snap my line. I'm not even gonna try for you. You can't move the boat in this one. You just kind of the game just kind of casts for you. I don't want you guys. All right, you know what? We're gonna reel in here. We're gonna put on a little bit heavier line, so maybe we'll be able to catch the tuna. This is what I wanted actually. This dolphin fish here. I believe they're called dolphin fish in this area. Although they actually, I think this area they're called Dorado. They might be called dolphin fish in the other areas. Yeah, the, some fish are reoccurring. Like, you see dolphin fish uh, in a couple different areas. You see blue marlin in a couple different areas. I believe you see barracuda in a couple different areas as well. Uh, in this area, they're mahi mahi, but these are reoccurring fish, so you will see them again. So let's see if we can't... I don't want another one of you. I want... Let's see if we can't find those tuna again. Yeah, the game just kind of casts for you. This, I believe, is either a Wahoo or a Barracuda. I don't remember which one. But the game just casts for you, and whatever fish just happen to spawn at that time of cast is whatever you can try and catch. So, <clears throat> you don't really get a ton of say about it, but, you know. You'll find out. 
This game is a lot of fun. I don't like either game particularly better than the other one. They're both pretty cool. Yeah, Barracuda. Okay. Where is this tuna? I want one of those blue tuna. There you are. No. Dolphin fish. Fuck off. Give me the tuna. No, I want the goddamn tuna. Get... Oh my god. I believe that was a... Wahoo on the side there. Alright, too many, too many dolphin fish. Uh, I need more tuna. There's a tuna. Give me the tuna. He was biting like crazy before, now he's not biting at all. Come on. Oh, there's a blue marlin. If he bites, he's gonna snap my line. Get out of here. So the reason I said I'm not gonna be able to catch as many many fish is because like I don't exactly know what each fish in this game likes. I don't remember very well. Do a recast here. And also, as you can see, it can take a little bit to find a particular fish that you're looking for. Just because it seems like the game kind of just randomly generates whatever it wants. Get out of here. I don't want you. You're kind of at the mercy of the game most of the time. Let's try a different bait. Um, let's try squid. See if we can't get some, uh, some action with squid. Maybe catch a tuna here. Okay, so he was a little heavier, I guess. Snap my line. So if he snaps my line, a tuna would definitely have snapped my line, so. Just want the goddamn tuna. I don't want you, and you keep pissing off all the tuna, you fucking asshole. Yeah, this is a different... I think this is the Wahoo. And if we catch him, I think the only one left in this area is the tuna. So we'll see if we can get the tuna. And if not, we'll just have to catch a fish and move on to the next area before time runs out on us here. Yeah, it's a Wahoo. Alright, so we got three minutes to catch ourselves a tuna. If the game will be nice enough to give us one. Come on, you... There we go. And my line wasn't heavy enough. <laughs> of course. I don't exactly remember how heavy the line has to be for the tuna. For the blue marlin, you usually just need 130 pound. Like, if you're not using 130 pound, you're going to snap your line. I don't want any of you. Tuna, though. Could you go for you? God damn it. Let's go up to 50. You know, don't exactly remember how heavy these things need to be. Here's a tuna. Line shy, that's fine. I don't want you anyway. You're line shy, that's fine. You definitely not line shy, but I don't want you. Damn, tuna needs 80 pound line. I don't think the tuna will bite a 130 pound line. I guess he needs 80 pound line. I was way under. I don't want either one of you. Get out of here. I don't want you either. I don't want any of you. I guess it makes sense. Like, these are pretty big tuna. These are ocean tuna. These aren't just, like, you know, shit fuck tuna that you find wherever. There's a tuna. A little too shallow. Urgh. We're running out of time. I think this will be the last. Ca get out of here. This will probably be the last 
cast we can really go for tuna here. Otherwise we're really just going to have to go for whatever we can get. Oh, come on, tuna. Come on, tuna. Not you. Alright. To avoid failing this area, we're just going to have to catch whatever now. If we can. You're going to run out of time. Ah. Come on. There we go. I got 18 seconds to him, and we're going to have to speed fight this guy. I don't know if we're going to make it. Oh, it's going to be close. Wow, we got him with 2.45 seconds left. <sighs> so we didn't get the tuna. That's fine. Two blue mons, a wahoo, a mahi mahi, and a barracuda. Didn't get our goddamn tuna. But that's fine. The We don't have to... We might be able to... I don't remember if there's tuna in this area necessarily. I know there's like barracuda and mahi-mahi and whatever the hell that thing is. I almost called it a smelt. It's definitely not a smelt. You're line shy? Okay. You're line shy as well. The reason I have this heavy line on is for the big fish in this area, which, I mean, besides the the blue marlin, which is in this area, but it's not as common as the last area, is this guy. The sailfish. He's pretty cool looking. These things are cool looking fish in real life. I used to just catch like five of these when I was in this area as a kid. Just I thought it looked so cool. 83 pound sailfish. Alright. I'll go down to 30 pound line and see what's up with these other two. Yeah, there's a blue marlin right there. Which I don't want him because he'll snap my line in half. I want... You're the same fish as before. You just have a different name. I guess I can show you the different name of this guy though. Because for some reason in different areas he's called different things. I mean, I guess that's kind of just to reflect like what the people in that particular area would call the fish, I guess. I mean, it does make sense, actually, now I think about it, because like, different people from different areas will call fish different things. So like in this area, they're called a dolphin fish, but it's really the same exact fish as the other area. I don't need you. I don't need you. You'll snap my line, I'm pretty sure. I need those gray things before that we're mucking about. Yeah, you. You're still line shy. Okay. Like I said, I haven't played this game in forever, so... It's, it's going to be a learning process for me as well as for you guys in this game. You want to... There we go. I don't remember what this fish is at all. And we have to catch the other guy who has like the yellow tips on his fins. Whatever his name is, I have no idea. Cobia. Okay. Interesting. It's a blue marlin, which I don't need. I need you. No, I don't need you. I just caught one of you. The other guy. Not you. Yeah, you. You, buddy. Not you, sailfish. Get out of here. I need Mr. Happy Pants over here. Not you. Catching a 
don't want to do, I guess. Just because, like, we really don't need to catch anything else besides that other fish now. So he'll be the last one we'll catch. We'll give ourselves plenty of time to try and catch him. Um, let's switch it up. Let's try a different kind of bait. Maybe he'll be more... There we go. Instantly, he switched up the kind of bait and he was all about it. Yeah, the lures in this game are alright, but I most of the time the live bait or the the organic bait I should say like so crab or the live bait tends to work pretty well the lures do have their purpose I believe the lures I believe certain fish will only go for a lure so it's a snook interesting but that's gonna do it for this episode guys as you can see we went through the first two areas I already failed to catch a fish which is awesome <laughs> so we'll have to go back and catch ourselves a tuna later but that's if he doesn't reappear, I don't remember. We'll have to find out. But you guys can catch me next time.